Hi, my name is Andrew Proka, and I work at Aero Systems Integration as a communications consultant and IoT developer. In this video, I would like to show you how Aero has integrated IoT into Avaya Breeze workflows, or snap ins as Avaya likes to call them. To understand this integration, you first need to know a little bit about Aero Connect, Aero's cloud based IoT integration platform. Aero Connect exists in three distinct spaces. First, there are the IoT sensors. These can be anything from temperature gauges to devices implanted into a cow's stomach that determine the health of the cow. These sensors connect to a gateway. A gateway can support a multitude of sensors of varying types. Gateways understand the specifics of how to communicate with a particular sensor. AeroConnect gateways push sensor data to a cloud application. This cloud application not only stores the data, but provides interfaces to query the data as well as trigger actions upon the data. AeroConnect interfaces with the outside world with RESTful web services. Using these web services and other technologies, AeroSI has created tasks that can be added to the existing Breeze Engagement Designer palette of tools. A Breeze developer simply drags one of our widgets into a workflow, specifies information about the desired sensor, and voila, the workflow can now act upon data from IoT devices anywhere in the world. It's time for a little show and tell. This is Engagement Designer. Engagement Designer allows you to build complex workflows with a number of different tasks. Those tasks can be notification tasks, such as sending emails, sending text messages, many, many telephony tasks in terms of making phone calls, dropping calls, forwarding calls. I have information down here to allow me to connect up to RESTful Web Services, read from databases. I have the ability to put in decision logic, sort of if then else. I have the ability to use the context store to store information about a particular workflow that can be accessed later by the same workflow or a different workflow. I have, I have the ability to um, do attribute uh, assignment to find a contact center agent to route a particular transaction to. And for the purposes of today, I have a brand new cabinet called AeroSI. AeroSI contains new tasks developed by Aero Systems Integration. There are three tasks for IoT, and there's another task for incident reporting. Starting with the IoT tasks, there's Aero IoT Snapshot. This one goes out to an IoT sensor and pulls the most recent information from that sensor. For instance, this could be a telemetry sensor that does temperature, humidity, light, and UV value. Aero IoT Snapshot would bring in the most recent values, the current temperature, the current humidity, the current light, and the current UV value. And those could be used inside of your workflow to make any kind of decision that you want to make based on that data. Aero IoT Trends, similar, except it looks at data over a large period of time. So instead of saying what's the most current data, I can say, well, I want to know what's the data for the past 20 minutes. But more specifically, I want to run analytics on it. I want to know over, the, let's say, the last 10, 20 minutes, what was the high, what was the low, what was the median, what was the average, and what was the trending. So Aero IoT snapshot might say the temperature is 73 degrees, but I want to know, did I rise to 73 degrees? Did I fall to 73 degrees? Have I been 73 degrees for some period of time? Over this time period, what was the high, what was the low, what was the average, and what was the median? That information can be used to determine, is there a problem, is there not a problem? Aero IoT device will go out and run device-specific commands. For instance, um, stop collecting data, start collecting data. There are a number of things that a device might do that Aero IoT device could be used for. And of course, these can all be connected together the way you would build a Breeze workflow. And you can add in all of the other things that Breeze can do. So I can have, um, you know, bring in information from an IoT device, determine who is the best person to handle this information, and then schedule 
uh, a contact center agent to deal with this problem or incident. Um, I can send again emails and text messages and make phone calls and, and call somebody and say the temperature is and then read back the temperature that was gathered by Aero IoT Snapshot or read back the trending information that was gathered by Aero IoT Trends or ask the user if they would like to stop the device or start the device and then use Aero IoT device to do so. The last one I want to talk about is Aero Insight Incident and what it does is it goes out to a cloud incident reporting system and opens up an incident report or a trouble ticket or however you want to call it. So for instance, I have a situation where the temperature is too high. I look at the trending information. I realize this is not an anomaly. The temperature has been rising over the last five minutes, 10 minutes, whatever. I can then create an incident report, assign a trouble ticket, and then the workflow for that trouble ticket kicks in and the, um, the technician goes out, handles the problem, comes back, resolves the problem, and then we can go back in the workflow and determine if the problem has been resolved properly. So all of these tasks combined together with the power of, of Aya Breeze create extremely complex and extremely functional workflows and solutions using IoT. I hope this helped you understand more of what AeroSI is doing with IoT and how Breeze developers can use our tools to enhance their workflows. The power of AeroConnect and IoT is tremendous. The types of workflows possible with Via Breeze are endless. Combining these two transformational technologies creates a development platform that is capable of creating world-class enterprise applications. Imagine alarm systems that can create conference calls. Picture being able to ask for a sensor's current values via text message. Envision a world where the lines between IoT devices and any form of communication are wiped away. That's the power of IoT integration from Arrow and Avaya.